Yo, what is good, you guys? It is your boy, Jason JV, and it looks like we're reaching the latter end of the uh, Gone uh, and Screwface Jan uh, saga. I guess the saga continues. Um, our man Gone put up a third diss track, a third, um, well, really a second response, but it's a third diss track. Um, but anyway, it's called Karma. Um... So far, Gone has not let us down when it comes to um, the uh, disses. So I'm gonna give this man a chance. You know what I'm saying? And uh, and uh, you know, like the hit, hit go. Stop all that crying shit. All right. Oh, I remember this dude. I think Church did a uh, roast video on this cat. <laughs> Roasted this dude like a turkey. All right. Like don't, 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 don't you dare. Cat. Don't, don't, don't you dare, bro. Just spit it out. All right. Quit dragging shit out. Spit it out, motherfucker. That's the stone and hide in your hands, you coward. Like, don't. That's what we're not going to do. We're not going to be they're taking it too far now, man. Boop, 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 boop. And we're not going to listen to any more of your bullshit, man. Pointed a diss at me, but I flipped it back on you, so you left disappointed. This picture of Screw looks like he's wearing. Tell me that it doesn't make it look like he's he's wearing makeup. He got he got his eyeliner on and the lipstick, bruh, bruh. Fucking Tu Wong Fu looking ass. <laughs> I'm just saying. Can you so you left disappointed? Funny thing about the rigor mortis when it hits a corpse and all your vital organs, it'll guarantee no round three. Six feet deep, sleep soundly. You must really be upset. You took five months to write a diss track, but I hit back and in six seconds you were dead. The defibrillate in his chest. Think I'ma resuscitate him just so I could make him fucking die again. It's time you learn some respect. Yeah. Why are you so obsessed with me? You got hella posters of me on your fucking wall. You're like a stalker. Keep my girlfriend. Bruh. <laughs> that is facts. It does look like a poster in the background. Bruh. Run out your mouth, y'all called her a tramp and a fucking donkey. So don't play victim when you get salty. I swear to God, you shouldn't have messed with me. Nah. Wanna talk about our loved ones? Then let's talk about our loved ones. Who went to jail for fraud when you were 17? Who? Damn. Ah. This motherfucker wasn't raised right If you tryna speak on people's families Just know the newspapers don't play nice Boy. It's no wonder that old members of your nation are sending Wait, what's that say? Dog, shut up, nobody cares what you think And hopefully you go back and read this message later in life And realize how much of an emotional douche you are LOL, <laughs> peace Who's that? Is that, is that, is that the screw? Fuck. DMs from when you were begging them for donations You promised to pay them back Instead ghosted them and took the cash And now becoming everything that you said you hate about Dex Damn. What's the matter, screw? You can dish it but can't take it? How's it feel to get a taste of your own medicine? Calling me Eminem is your only weapon See, I told y'all I called this shit, you know what I mean? I knew he, he was gonna... Say, you know, they'll want to be Eminem, and then, but then, like I said, screw, what Screw should have done, I don't know if it would have made much of a difference, but he shouldn't have posted his album picture up when he mentioned Slime Shady, because then after that, that's when he accused uh, our man Gone here of dressing up like M, walking like M, trying to be like M, but look at Screw, he's trying to be like M too, so... See, it's it's easy to diss a cat like Screw, man, because like I said, they this is the kind of guy who sets himself up, you know, for a punchline. And you should know better that ain't enough of a diss to put me in a hole, let alone impress us. You basically admit my flow's better. Yeah, my jacket's leather. It's called fashion. All you rock is old sweaters. All you said on your last record was that you could whoop my ass or shoot me with guns. That'd be your only chance to beat me. If screw is such a tough guy. Which is nothing original about that either. Like, you know, you're beating up someone or uh, you, you're, you're going to fucking shoot someone, which makes you look like even a much bigger pussy. Because everyone knows real, real tough guys, they, they, they fight. They don't kill. You know what I mean? 
if you're, if you're, if you're gonna be Billy Badass, fucking show, show us what you can do with these, with your hands. You know what I mean? Put that gun away, man, because that makes you look like a fucking bitch. Uh, yo, how come he picks on girls, but no one's ever seen him throw a punch, you little bug-eyed hoe? Now I'm hurting you. There won't ever come a day on Twitter where they don't say that I murdered you. Mumfu shedding tears at your funeral while I'm burying dirt on you. I'ma make sure by the time I'm done with this, it's undisputable. You're sure to lose. Moment of silence for the body of a person. I just murked his name a screw, and I would like to say a word or two. It's tragic that he died a virgin. He was such a humble dude. What a shame that Mumfu lost his husband to the wrath of Luke. Boo. Oh, so that's who Mumfu is. Okay. Okay, now we know the name of that. He was such a humble dude. What a shame that Mumfu lost his husband to. So that's Mumfu. Okay. okay. For the wrath of Luke. Boo. And Dante said I was so corny with the flows that I'm just as bad as mumble rappers. Whoa. Well, you could tell this Urkel looking boy that I'ma smack his glasses so damn far up off his nose. He'll be moving slow as ASAP Rocky Stroke. Yeah, that's the line removed from World War III. It was tongue in cheek. Dante roasted me first. Now Screwface John tries to pull that fucking race card. Oh, please. You say everybody's racist that you battle because we put your ass to sleep. Huh? And that's why I, I can't take Screw seriously when it comes to dissing, man. Because if you're a, if you're not a if you're a non-black rapper, let's put it that way, you know what I'm saying? Then you pretty much know what Screw's gonna come at you with, accusing you of being racist. Hell, Screw's probably gonna accuse me of being racist because I've been showing more love to Gone than I had to Screw. But Screw, like I said, did it to himself. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry. I don't I don't support rappers when they on a diss track that. You know, use the fucking race card as their crutch. Because, like I said, when you when you use the, the fucking race card, you're basically using a, a victim card. And you're turning yourself... And you went from being a warrior on a diss track to now a victim on a diss track. And victims never win. Victims will always take the L. So, remember that. When you, you, you go at someone and you accuse them of being a racist on a diss track, you're no longer a warrior. You're, you're a victim. You now want people to feel sorry for you. You want you want people to say that that you won out of pity, but really no. You that's, that's an automatic L because victims never win; they always lose, and that's facts. All I'm hearing are excuses from a loser getting beat. You the one who's publicly tweeting white rappers have to leave. Man, I'm sorry that you hate me for my race. I'm a guest in hip hop hell yeah, and I'm never taking your bait. It's too late. You said. And, and it's so stupid for him to be um, doing this kind of stuff too, accusing white rappers of being racist, because he works with white, white rappers, or at least he used to. He works with Crypt, and he used to work with Blindsight, and he worked with Mac Lethal. So, you know what I mean? So I wouldn't be surprised if all those cats that I just named right now no longer work with Screw because of the way that he is on on his diss tracks. And just the way that he is as a person. I'm sorry. You hate me for my race. I'm a guest in hip hop. Hell yeah, and I'm never taking your bait. It's too late. You said chess, not check as guest. This is checkmate. You a battle rapper getting outsmarted by a commercial artist. Just toasted his ass like Pop Tarts. You had five months and three people who were trying to harm me, but I out wrapped them in one hour. I guess that's why they call me Karma. Uh, Shizzy Snake Six begging me for a collab. I could give a fuck about how good you rap. You expose yourself a phone. And Sh Shizzy's not a good rapper. Stop giving this guy credit. He's not that good of a rapper. I'm sorry. Someone who started out their verse with using the, we're trying to rhyme the N word three times. No, and it's not a good rapper. For someone who kept using forefront as, as a rhyme. No, sorry, that's not a good rapper. You know what I mean? It's just not. Only you a cornball for that act. Go ahead, come at me again. No, I don't give a damn. Pictures worth a thousand words. I'm done responding to your rest. Battle rap is cool, but y'all can't earn a living off that crap. Something I learned about six. He's a bitch. Makes excuses for everything. Most insecure person ever. That's a fact. Y'all are whack. Looking back, Mumfu, he was trying to rap. All his ex girls' tweets show support for all of that. Holy shit, I just figured out the puzzle and it's lit. Mumfu hates all of us rappers cause his music never hit. Lost his girl and then career, so now he's eating like a pig. Even though he lost his battle, his obesity. Mumfu hates Hobson, he hates Upchurch, he hates, uh, well, I guess gone now. And then, um, yeah, he, he's bitter. He's always been a bitter dude. Oh, when come to think. 
and he flat out admitted it himself. Even though we lost this battle, his obesity will win. Come to think, this whole situation's funny, check the facts. Three 30-year-old men spending half a year plotting on my ass. What the hell? Y'all done took the L before we even rapped. That's a tough pill to swallow for your fans. You two battle rappers murdered by suburban kid. I laugh, cause they keep on coming back. Y'all must really fucking love me, check your pants. At this point around, three would just be sad. Quit obsessing over me, talking about how you'll beat my ass. Y'all must be so damn mad. Luke gone, that clout chasing cornball kid. Really doesn't give a shit. Y'all to suck my dick. Damn. Yeah, honestly, guys, I feel like Gone didn't even need to make this because really, this is like part of the the weakest of the three diss tracks he put out. I thought the uh, first two were his strongest ones. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I could could have done without this one, but I mean, either way though, it's that final nail in the coffin. Scragging. <laughs>